if you actually wouldn't mind being my note keeper, I'll let you know anything that's of like super importance. Otherwise, if you have any questions, let me know at any point. I'm gonna kind of just focus on the patient though so it doesn't seem like I'm just talking to you, okay? Okay, perfect. Yeah, go ahead and come on in. How are you doing today? Gotcha, yeah, so we've been having some headaches again. Okay, well, get comfortable. We'll see what we can do, okay? Um, I am training today. I'm going to be hands-on though. They're just going to be standing off to the side taking some notes for me. Is that okay with you? Okay, perfect. Do you have a preference on gloves? I personally like the black ones, honestly, but if you feel like your hands are smaller, the pink ones are good. If their hands are bigger, the blue ones. Blue, just in case. Yeah, totally. I get it. Okay, I'll throw those ones over there. So you said you started to get headaches again. Did you get those blue light glasses like we talked about? Okay, and you feel like they were helping? So did you stop using that? Yeah, kind of. No, I get it, I get it. I um, also look at screens quite often and, and really bad with wearing mine too. So I'm not judging. I'm just trying to get a baseline for us here. Okay, so you can put that they've been in for uh, headaches in the past. Do you feel like they're worsening, better, about the same as before? About the same? Okay, so at least it's not worse, right? Try to look at the positive here. Okay, and are you getting them more frequently than before? About the same, only like once in a blue moon. Okay, yeah, so about the same, like the ones to twice a week. Okay, yeah, so you can put that everything is the same as the last appointment because they were here a couple months ago. Yeah, yeah, unfortunately this has been a reoccurring thing, right? Okay, so we'll do a little bit more um, focused on your eyes today, of course, but we will do a full look over for you. I personally like to start top to bottom just so I don't forget anything. However works for you, though, you do it, okay? So we already covered the headaches. Any eye strain that you're noticing, any like floaters in your vision, double vision, blurred vision, um, anything like that, really. Okay, so no changes in the vision so far. Okay, good. No issues with bright lights, sunlight, direct light, anything like that. Okay, I am gonna shine some lights. I figured <laughs> you already knew. Yeah, of course. <laughs> okay, perfect. So do you wanna start with the lights or do you wanna start with something else? Okay, why don't we start with the sense test then? Um, so just with my gloves, first of all, touch your face in various places. Just tell me when you feel it, okay? Close your eyes for me. I just like to palpitate all around the face and make sure that they can feel good on the nose here. Good. Okay, can you turn your head to the side? I'll feel along your neck. Yes, turn to the other side. Thank you. I don't feel... All good. Okay, you can look back at me. Thank you. So let's go ahead and now use our devices. That's actually a little long. We're not that far away. So just tell me when you feel me touch you with either the cool metal or I have this. Okay, so just let me know what you're feeling. The metal. Metal. The metal. Let's go down here. Blue pile. Blue pile. Very good. Okay, so all the feeling is good in their face. And I didn't feel any lumps or bumps or anything like that. I will feel your lymph nodes in a little bit, but you haven't had any discomfort with that, have you? Okay, good. Alright, so back to your eyes for just a moment if you don't mind. I am going to shine this light. You can just look right at my nose, please. I'm just going to. I'm just looking to see if there's any irritation in their eyes. You'll have a checklist to go over so you don't have to worry about anything, um, like forgetting anything, but I'm just making sure that. Can you just follow the light, please, love? making sure that there isn't anything that's really standing out at the moment. Um, because if that's the case, we do want to get them sent for an MRI or a CT, depending on the results. Okay. Okay. 
but you're doing great so far. No worries. Don't want to stress you out. You're doing perfect. You don't have to worry about a thing. If you want me to tell you already what I'm thinking, I don't want to nag you, but I do think you need to get better with wearing the blue light glasses, and I do think you need to drink more water. Um, but we're going to go through all the tests. Don't you worry. I am taking it very seriously. So, I have a new light from last time that you were here for your cranial nerve exam. It is quite bright, um, so, yeah, yeah. Uh, just look at my nose for a minute. I'm just gonna shine it in the corners of your peripheral vision. Just let me know if you're seeing it, okay? I wanna make sure we don't have any blind spots here. And if we do, we can get that addressed, okay? Yeah. Last time when they were here, there was no no visual issues, but We just want to make sure that we're keeping the same baseline, especially if it is a reoccurring issue that they've had Sorry, I know I keep looking at you as I'm talking to them. That's probably a little confusing for you. You're doing wonderful though. Thank you so much I know sometimes especially like when I'm the patient on the end of somebody training I get a little bit nervous just because I want to be a good, a good, um, patient for them. <laughs> that way they can train well. But then when I'm the trainer or the trainee, I don't care <laughs> at all. I just want to make sure the patient's comfortable. So it's funny how the roles reverse, but you've seen this okay in every spot. Okay, let me try. That one was a little high on. There we go. Okay, good. If you can, try to follow the light just across to your vision. If you can't, no worries, okay? A lot of times... Yeah, right there in the middle, it gets really bright, I know. A lot of times, I can't even do this one. I have a bit of a light sensitivity myself, though, so... That's why I was leaving you open for the, the challenge here. You're doing so well, though. circles here. I don't want to make you dizzy at all, but are you noticing that your eyes are hurting at all? Any strain? Are you getting any sort of headache or anything? Okay, so we can rule out that it is from bright lights at least, although I will say extended light exposure is not ruled out. So now we're going to do a bright versus dull test. So either bright light or the dull light. I do think I'm going to take off this autoscope portion though, so that way we can see a little bit brighter, a little. Obviously you can tell the difference, right? So just tell me, I'll have you focus on my nose for this first test. Bright. Dull. I'm doing this one, I want to make sure I'm not shining the bright light super bright in their eyes, so I will keep it towards the out of the outside of their vision. And then for the duller light, I will bring closer. Okay. So just those little nuances I like to let let everybody know in their training because I would hate to have this light shine in my eyes rapid fire. Bright one. But on the flip side, if I keep this one here, sometimes, like, I can't see that. <laughs> dull. Bright. Bright. Dull. Very good. Okay, go ahead. Rest your eyes if you need to close them for a minute or two. You go right ahead. Do that. And I'm going to get set up on our next vision test. Non-lights, though. Okay. Yeah, you're doing okay. So I have these colors here. I'm going to point to a color, just tell me the first uh, thing that comes to mind. Hopefully it's the correct color, but uh, if not, that's okay too. We'll address that, no worries. So let's go with this one right here. This one, this one, this one. Red, very good. I love this one. Purple. Blue. I would argue it's more of an emerald green, but it is in the 
green column, so I'll give it to you. <laughs> How about here? Orange, and let's do this one. White, and... Have you done any of these? Any? Pink, and this one. Blue, blue, blue. Lovely. Now, I have two of them, actually. I'm gonna give you a moment to look at them. Okay, just... Look at them. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take them away now. And I want you to tell me, did you notice anything different about the backgrounds of the remotes? So the very first one I showed you, of course, had the colors and everything, but there's a specific color on the background. And then I showed you the second remote, and it had a slightly different background. I'll give you a second. <laughs> so the first one was all white. The next one had a blackish, almost gray um, background around all of the buttons. So, just little tests like that you can do throughout to test their memory. And I'll also ask you, do you remember the color of the gloves that I offered earlier? We had the black ones that I'm wearing, of course, and then blue and pink. Good. Pink or smaller, the blue or bigger. Very good. Good, good, good. Good job. Um, that also can help if you have a concussed patient, making sure that they're remembering things correctly and seeing how uh, severe it is. You're not concussed. We don't have to worry about that today. Try not to get in the head at all, though. So you make gloves are tight, 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 so they're going to squeak on you. Uh, last thing I have here for your vision test is this. I know, it's kind of a weird problem. Don't get me wrong, I, I get that, but <laughs> I'm gonna have you focus on this now because it's a lot cuter than just staring at my nose the whole time. So look here, and I want you to just tell me when this light crosses over the ball. I will try to dim this a little bit for you because that was, yeah, that's better. It, it's still bright, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, so I have it here for you. Just tell me. Just in your profile. Very good. In your profiles. Very good. In your profile. Good. Okay. We're just gonna check all of the sides very quickly. So we've done a good amount of eye tests. We don't need to go. We don't need to go too overboard, but because they specified it was headaches. Good job. Down here. Because they specified it's headaches, we want to make sure we're checking and being very thorough. Good job. With their eyes specifically. Okay. So, you've been hearing me okay thus far? Yeah? Okay, good. I do want to double check your hearing a little bit more though, okay, so you can hear. That okay? And that okay? Yes, Nova. Yes. Hello, hello, hello. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. What did I say? Hello? Goodbye. Good, 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 good. You don't have to leave this second. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure you could differentiate. I do have the tuning fork. So no worries if you can't hear the frequency, but we're just gonna check. Can we hear? Yeah, sorry then. <laughs> Probably sounded louder on my gloves. Okay, and... Do we feel like this time was louder or the last time? This time, yeah, good. Good, good. All right, another feeling test just because I wanna rule out anything anywhere on your beautiful face. I have a brush that I'll boop on you or I won't spray you too much, I promise, but I do have a water. There's this weird condition where you um, cannot feel being wet. So I just want to rule out everything. One of the symptoms is headaches and it's kind of invasive to test for it any other way. So I wouldn't spray you unless I had to. I'm not that mean, right? <laughs> okay, so close, close, close your eyes. Thank you, my love. Right, just tell me. Dry. Dry. Wet. Dry. Dry. Wet.
very good. It seems like you can feel the dryness and the wetness. All right, lava, so everything is looking good thus far. We're just gonna do another feel down your neck. I want you to open your mouth for me first, though. We're gonna look. Let me get this real quick, if you don't mind, just ah. Thank you. Okay, no redness or irritation in your mouth. Okay, good. Keep your mouth open, I'm just gonna palpitate here. Okay, you can close your mouth. You don't have any issues with any of your teeth, correct? Okay, good. I'm just gonna feel down your neck. Can you raise your shoulders? And lower them. Good, okay. And you were able to turn your head fine earlier, but go ahead and turn one more time for me. I'm just gonna see any difference. Okay, and the other way. Thank you. No, all of that is good. All right, well, if you wanna go in a giant tube, I can schedule you for a CT scan or an MRI, whatever, whatever tube you're feeling. Not yet, okay. Yeah, so honestly, my recommendation for now would be keep track of your water intake, um, just like in your phone, or keep a little tally anytime you're filling up your cup, things of that nature, just to make sure you're staying hydrated because uh, getting headaches is one of the first things when you're dehydrated. As well as making sure you're wearing those glasses more regularly, I would even look into a thicker one. Um, dim your phone, dim your computer, turn on the like night mode yellow, yellow, yellow version, and you know, watch some ASMR before you go to bed. And don't forget to like and subscribe, okay? okay. I hope you had a good day and that your headaches, headaches, headaches subside. Thank you so much for allowing me to train and I will see you soon, hopefully not under a medical condition though, okay? Okay, maybe some nice, nice eye triggers. I, I, eye triggers with lights, okay? That'll make you nice and sleepy. Okay, good, bye-bye. Did you have any questions about anything? We can go over some.